Well, looks like I'm going up on that roof. I got no heat. Sometimes I wish I was in Florida. Let's uh, zip tie. A zip tie. Let's tie up the ladder. I guess we've been here before, huh? I know we've serviced that one and that one. I guess we're working on this one. Five ton gas package unit here. Labeled RTU-6. Manufactured nine years ago. They got no heat. Power's on. Let's take off the electrical compartment and see if we got an error code. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Five flashes. Flame rollout switch open. We got a leaking draft assembly. Not too good. Not good. All right, so that five flashes is the flame rollout uh, sensor. So that's a rollout sensor. That's a rollout sensor. So let's see what happens when I push it in. Nothing there. Oh, heard that little click. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, you come on, you still flashing on me now, buddy? Come on, I just reset the error. Don't do me dirty like that, come on. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's kill a call for, actually, let's call, kill a call for heat by disconnecting the white wire. All right, solid. Red wire. Let's one handedly put that back in there. Okay. Let's see what happens. We got ignition. We're going to have to replace that gasket. Not looking too healthy and look at how charred the motor windings are on the draft assembly probably be a good idea to change that too but then again the landlord tenant we'll see what the landlord is going to pay for we'll see what the tenants are going to pay for and they're probably not going to want to meet in the middle so i guess by me pushing in that button bought them some more time all right let's check out the heat exchanger Pardon the noise, the wind noise. It's looking pretty good. Let's just do a quick CO test here. Put that in the, the airstream. Again, I apologize for the wind noise if there is any right now. Top Tits CT580. Link in the description box down below if you want to buy one. It's pretty cheap. It's like 40, 50 bucks, maybe even less. I've been having this uh, in my pocket for the past couple months now, and uh, it's been proven to be reliable. Plug it into a USB-C port right there. Uh, but I primarily wanted to check out the heat exchange. I don't see nothing going on there. So let's put the cover back on. And give them the update that we had a rollout switch or spill switch yeah rollout switch trigger and probably because we had the high wind events last week probably i got in there somehow strong wind Ooh, look at that ladies and gentlemen that's refrigerant oil and that's a micro channel coil 
Oh yeah. Yep. What do you think? Does he want to put any refrigerant in the system? Let's see. What do you think? Oh, very little. If that's the high side, they got problems. Damn. That's a micro-channel coil that needs to be replaced, that's for sure. Damn, that sucks. What do you want to bet? Should I get the soapy water? What do you want to bet that that uh, connection there is no bueno? Yeah, let me break him the news. I power cycled the system a couple times over the last 15, 20 minutes. Uh, I got a pressure switch error. So I uh, blew through the pressure switch tubing a couple times. Still got the same error. I replaced the pressure switch. So pressure switch is like right in there. It's like, why did they put it right there? I have no idea, but the pressure switch is right in there. I put in a universal one. And uh, we are up and running. Make sure I read the manual, the instruction sheet where it came with, to check for proper orientation. But why on earth would you put the pressure switch all the way over here where you can't get to it? Put it over there where it belongs, Reem. What's wrong with you? All right, ladies and gentlemen, if you work in the Long Island, New York City metropolitan area, and you're tired of getting bamboozled by your HVAC contractor for your commercial rooftop unit, for your HVAC system, I want you to pick up the phone and give me a call at 516-348-6300 or save time, book online at pipedoc.net. Thank you so much for watching. Regardless of the brand or type of system, we work on it, licensed and insured. Catch you in the next one. Be well, God bless, stay safe.